New York Yankees fans, how's it going yet again? It is Felix from NYNews.com. Like always, hola, como estas? New York Yankees fans, are you ready? Are you ready for this team to get absolutely savage? These aren't your 2017 Yankees. These are your 2019 Yankees. These are the Yankees that shine bright under the spotlight. The London series. Oh, the camera's on the Yankees, huh? We're going to perform. Oh, that Dodgers series? When supposedly the Dodgers were the best team in baseball? We're going to perform as well, even though the Yankees could have swept that series because of a corrupted or bozo umpire. They knew the spotlight was on them, and they performed, let's say, at 110%, at the maximum. But Felix, that doesn't make sense. 110% is above 100 Fast forward to the ALDS. Spotlight on the Yankees. They perform. This team performs better when all the cameras are pointed at them. If you follow me on Twitter, underscore n News, you have seen my predictions. I said, I called it, or I'm calling it, I called it as of three weeks now, that I believe the matchup you're going to see in 2019's World Series is going to be the Nationals versus the Yankees. And yes, I got my few comments by Trolls. Um, let me smoke that crack you're smoking, Felix. But there we go. The Cardinals are not going to come back. I believe that the picture they had to beat was Annabelle Sanchez. They couldn't beat him. Now they got to beat Corbin, Mad Max, and Strasburg. Mad Max, Corbin, Strasburg. Um, they have a tough road. So I believe still that the Nationals and the Yankees are going to be your two teams that make it to the World Series. But the Yankees still have to face the Astros. The Astros are the best team in baseball, right? They got the best pitching staff. Cole is amazing. Justin Verlander, Superman, right? Granky. Oh, my God. But I'm going to tell you this, folks. This Astros team, I believe the 2017 Astros were better than the 2019 Astros. Why do I say this? Because the 2017 Astros had momentum. Sure, the 2019 Astros won 100 plus games. They're considered the best staff in baseball. Whatever. I believe that this 2019 Astros team is similar to the 2019 Dodgers. There's many factors that I believe the Astros are going to lose the series against the Yankees in about six games or five for these reasons. Cole is pitching amazing, right? But Cole is going to blow up. He's going to implode once he steps the mound at Yankee Stadium. I believe that. Grinky, I believe the Yankees are going to light him up. Justin Verlander, I love the guy. He's one of my favorite pitchers, but he's not the same JV of 2017. I can't see where JV has a great or superb game against the Yankees like he did in those games in 2017 and 2019. For this fact alone, the Rays did a great job at trolling the Astros. They took them to the final game of that ALDS. They tired them out a bit. JV is going up there in age. We're progressing into the postseason. All those games in the regular season. I can't see how Justin Verlander has, let's say, more in the tank to face a lineup like the New York Yankees. Which, in my opinion, this lineup that they put together when we saw it in the ALDS looked like an all-star lineup. It was perfect. All the stars are aligning. The Yankees are the team with the momentum. Like I told you, again, in my previous statements, this is the team that likes the spotlight on them. This particular team, I'm not talking about the 2018 Yankees, and I'm not talking about the 2017 Yankees. I am talking about the 2019 Yankees specifically. We didn't have Labor Torres back then. We didn't have DJ LeMayhew back then when we faced them in 2017 and almost beat them. We were up 3-2. to two. This is a different team, folks. This bullpen that the Yankees have is completely devastating. Comparing it to the Astros bullpen. This is a bullpen that, in my opinion, is one of the best bullpens ever assembled in the history of Major League Baseball, even though we don't have Batances. 
I am super extremely confident that the Yankees are going to take this series, and I am extremely confident that number 28 is coming very soon. Also to note, the Rays exposed the Astros' tactics of what the Astros' players are looking for. If a pitcher is tipping pitches, possibly stealing signs, the Yankees are prepared, folks. The analytical nerds, they're ready. They're prepared. They ha they've had a boatload of time to analyze the Astros before this ALCS. What they were doing, how they were playing, their weaknesses, because they faced our little brother from the AL East, the Rays. So all the tricks the Astros use, stealing signs, seeing if a pitcher is tipping pitches, the Yankees and their staff, they're ready for it. The players are ready for it. In my opinion, the Yankees are completely going to run over the Astros. Cole isn't going to be Jack, you know what, against the Yankees. He looks to me, sure, he has over 300 strikeouts this season. But in my opinion, he looks like a head case. He can't handle the pressure of, you know, pitching in New York or against the Yankees in a big situation. I'm sorry, JV, your luck has run out. You're going up there in age. Sure, you're still nasty, over 300 strikeouts. But come on, that arm is going to fall off. The Rays took you guys to the max. You guys are basically going to be tired once you face the New York Yankees. You can't, you know... Start Verlander for game one, put him in there for game three as relief or whatever. You know, one of those aces that they put out there like uh, Chris Sale to shut down a team as a closer. That's not going to happen this time, folks. The Yankees are too deep. They hit the home run ball. They're hitting with runners in scoring position. They actually have players on this ball club like DJ LeMayhew that hit for average, move runners around. This is a hitting machine. Folks. What I'm trying to say here is, this ain't your 2017 Yankees. These are the 2019 Yankees, a completely different ball club. The Rays and the Yankees matched up plenty of times this season. And look at that, the Rays took the Astros to the last game of the LDS. You know, the Yankees are savage. They are completely savages. Don't worry about it, they got this. And hey, guess what player has something to prove? John Carlos Stanton. Hey, like I said, all the stars are aligning. The Yankees have a whole bunch of positive things going for them. So, Yankees fans, like always, leave your opinions in the comment section below. Where do you guys think this series is headed? Do you think the Yankees are going to beat the Astros in five games, six games, or even seven, or even maybe a sweep? Leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from nynews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you out next time. Before it hits the front page